This is another Mid-Atlantic Mafia exclusive. AllBeMoreHipHop.com. Log on. What's up, y'all? My name is Ebony. Um, Baltimore's R&B princess. Um, as far as my projects that I'm working on right now, I'm working on my actually third solo album. I'm releasing it September the 1st. Uh, it's going to be in stores, it's going to be in the Mentions of Music, and it's going to be in Metro 2 and Rice's Town Road Plaza. September 1st, um, work with some hot producers. We got Game from Philly. Um, we also got, let me see, on the, on, on, this, uh, on, the, on the album, we got Raw Queen, we got Jeff, a um, couple dudes, you know, in Baltimore. Um, CD going to be real hot. Uh, 12 tracks, fire. Got it. Um, my style, uh, as far I, I would describe my style uh, like neo soulish, no soulish, neo soulish, <laughs> with like a a, a slash of R and B. Um, and as far as like my voice, I've been you know compared at times to um, Brandy's the one that I can remember the most. Like I have uh, more so it's like a like a soft like a soft. Uh, singing voice. Um, some of the challenges being a female singer, I think honestly coming from anywhere as opposed to Baltimore, um, it's just people taking you seriously. You know, they automatically think that sh that you in the game, you know, if if you if you're doing the music then you gotta you gotta have something hanging out or you gotta give something up or you gotta give somebody something to get on or whatever and that's totally what I'm not about about, you know what I'm saying? So um I'm just about just being real, you know what I'm saying, just in, in you know, anything as far as that, you know, if, if anything as far as that, I confront that head on, you know what I'm saying, and, and I'm just, you know, I'm a real artist, I don't do the, you know, I think honestly that's, that's the main challenge that I face as a female artist, period, as opposed to Baltimore and everything, you know what I'm saying, but as far as Baltimore, um, I think a, a, any artist in Baltimore, period, you know what I'm saying, it's, I don't think they give Baltimore as much credit as we deserve, you know what I'm saying? So whether you're a rapper, producer, a singer, whatever, you know what I'm saying? You know, the industry, honestly, in my opinion, doesn't give Baltimore a lot of credit. So we deserve much more because it's some real, you know, it's some real hotness in Baltimore. So I meet a lot of artists and I honestly, I work with a lot of artists that I really feel, you know what I'm saying? They, they got that it fact or whatever, but I don't think we as a whole take ourselves serious enough to really push it and, and do what we gotta do to get on the mat. Like when I go out of town, I meet artists that I mean they'll they'll stand on the block and they'll sell you a C D. You they'll give you a C D if you give them a dime. You know what I'm saying? I just met this dude in Atlanta, you know what I'm saying, taking donations and honestly all I had in my pocketbook was like change and he gave me a CD, you know what I'm saying? Like they don't have the they don't got the, the grind in them that 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 they that that we're supposed to have. I don't want to say that, but um, as a whole, I think that's what the artists in Baltimore are miss is missing right now. And I think if it if it was enough of us to to, to just get that grind, get that fire behind us, or whatever, like we could really like do some we could really do some stuff. What's up? All be more hip hop dot com. It's your girl Ebony. Shout out the Mid Atlantic Mafia.